Hello, friends. Where is my capture card? There it is. There it is. And all is well. Hello, I, I hope you are doing well as well. Wait, what was the, what was the last thing I streamed on, uh... What was the last thing I streamed on this capture card? Was it, uh, also a thousand year door? Yeah, it was. Okay. I just needed to know if I needed to change the volume at all. But it seems that I don't. So, <clears throat> we can just get started, I think. Hold on. Boop. Boop. Got a cool new stream embed in my Discord, even though the Twitch viewer count doesn't seem to be working. But whatever, that doesn't matter right now. All that matters is a pap. 
And Waluigi must get that last crystal star. But first... I, I got a couple other things I need to do before we actually do that. First of all, what do you got? You know what? I'll get that. It'll it'll save me from having to go to the the main. But I I need one badge point. What what costs one badge point? That does. First time- there it is, okay. But yeah, first I need to go check- Oh wait, wait, I forgot the bit rate is wrong. I mean the bit- the bit rate is fine. Oh, she smells something. The bit rate is fine, but I want it to be more. I crave a greater bit rate, this game deserves it. Okay, I'm willing to bet there's a star piece somewhere. Where is it? Where is it? Where's my star piece? Where's my money, Denny? Oh, there it is. It's right- it's right there. Sorry, just checking something real quick. Oh, actually, the- the chat- the chat embed, I might want to flip that next time, because that's not how... That is not how chats tend to work. You tend to have the most recent on the bottom. I mean, I guess I could do that right now. You know, why not? Why not? Just waste everybody's time. Waste everybody's freaking time. So, yeah, two, two, one, zero. All right. Do I have it set to update? I don't think I have it set to update, so... I need to do that real quick, too. But I can- I can do that with a quick copy paste. I can make that happen very quickly. Except that it keeps appearing on the wrong monitor. But besides- besides that... Besides that. It has been updating as far as I- yeah, I know. I just- I was switching the order of the- the chat there. Because usually people expect the most recent chats to be at the bottom. I feel like that would make more sense. Now- do I have poor impulse control and probably should have done that while I wasn't streaming? Absolutely yes. But here we are. Oh hey, I actually got one. Yeah, I'll take it. I will take it. Now what did I, what did I come over here to do? Oh, it was that. It, I, I literally came over here to do that. Okay, but first we need to listen to Desert Man's Desert Stories. We need to know what he went through, and then we can actually progress with the game. But yeah, the one thing that's still not working on it is I want it to show how many viewers there are. And right now, it's not doing that. I, I messed something up with that, but whatever. We'll figure that out later. Okay, so, the night before. The night before. I'm finally off tomorrow. I filled my pack with cheese, and I'm ready to go. 
My to-do list is crossed off. I owe so much to all of my investors, not just money. The old get-rich-quick dream, but this is different. I have a reason. See, I owe it to my hometown. It's so cold there, people are constantly shivering. If I find oil and send it there, then people can use it to heat their homes. Oil will make me rich and them happy. Seems to be the perfect goal, right? I have always, always had this dream since I was very small. Of course, getting rich is a big part of it too, but who doesn't want money? Money, money, cover me with it, please. Ha! <sighs> well, enough for tonight. Yeah, that's a little embarrassing. Read another? Yeah. Why did it all have to turn out like this? I got to Toad Town by boat, and then took a train to the foot of Mount Rugged. Again, many, many recent, <laughs> many Paper Mario. Uh, let me see. Hmm. Yeah, it's it. it yeah, the Prime message seems to not have been counted. But yeah, Paper Mario 64 reference again. They really like to reference that game. Unfortunately, you can only get to Mount Rugged to Dry Dry Desert on foot. And tragedy waited for me as I slogged faithfully up that winding trail. It was a huge, awful vulture. I had read about it in my travel brochures. Yeah, I met that. I met that guy. I know him! This Buzzar coasted all travelers on Mount Rugged. I hightailed it, but Buzzar had me in its sights. I felt a piercing jolt as its claws dug deep into my backpack. After dropping me onto a cliff, Buzzar seemed to forget me and disappear. I let out a big sigh of relief, but when I touched my back, I noticed my pack was gone. My pack! In it was all my food and money to start the operation. No! That mangy Buzzar made off with everything of importance to me. All I have left is this journal, a shovel to dig for oil, and my life. But perhaps living is a miracle enough, or so I'd like to believe. But now I can't turn back. I climb down the mountain to the desert. The dry, dry desert sprawls out before me, beckoning dreamers and fools. I am both, and I set out with a heart full of dread. I had a heart full of dread after that one direct. A helping hand. I'm now in a place called Dry Dry Outpost. Someone pulled me, lifeless and parched, from the merciless desert floor. Connection taken a dookie? Uh... Not that I can tell. I, I don't see anything. It was a Koopa with a fine mustache named Colorado. An angel in a pith helmet. He was a world-traveling adventurer or archaeologist. I told him about Buzzar, and my quest for oil, and my dreams of riches and warmth for my people. After I spoke at length, he gave me food and water. I asked him why he should be so kind, and he looked into the distance and said, Putting one's back on an ambitious dreamer invites others to do the same to you, old boy. I just... I just want to believe in every dream this sad old world can muster. This guy, he still chases his own dreams. Dusty dreams of archaeology. We stayed up all night discussing each other's dreams. It was great. I am now at a desert oasis. After Colorado left, I set out from Dry Dry Outpost to find my digging point. But the desert is so wide, it's impossible to find anything without a guide. I had no idea where I was going, and my head was splitting in the heat. My throat was burning and scratchy. Was I awake? Was I asleep? I heard a voice calling to me from far away. Hey, are you a nice guy? If you're a nice guy, then give me something. Not just every, every Paper Mario 64 reference they can think to add. Or, I mean, or at least anything that has to do with chapter two. <laughs> Just the entirety of Chapter 2 is in here. I didn't have the food or water I received from Colorado. I had nothing. Why do you lie here? If you are a nice guy, give me a nice thing and I will help. I croaked. All I have is... All I have is my dream. When I next awoke, I was at, the o at this oasis. You're awake, I heard. There was a little Mauser there in a gray head scarf. My name is Mouse Mustafa. 
You had nothing to give, but I got something nice anyway. I don't know how or why, but it seems I've been saved by yet another stranger. Do you need a guide? If there is somewhere you want to go, I will take you. Unbelievable, I've actually found a reliable guide. A digging point. We're here. I'm finally at the spot where I'm supposed to dig for oil. I was told to draw a line from a blue cactus to a cactus-like rock. I mean, say what you will, as... <laughs> as thick as the references to Paper Mario 64 are in this game, it does feel good for there to be that continuity, you know? Mario doesn't always have, like, really heavy continuity. So, it, it is nice to be like, Hey, you remember that game you played on the Nintendo 64? Yeah, that still happened! <laughs> I went north a precise distance from the exact termination point. I ended up here, at a point between dry dry ruins and the oasis. Maustafa has guided me this far with skill and bravery. He said, you are a nice guy. Your dream will come true. Maustafa believes this. He left then, leaving me to fight this battle on my own. All I have to do is dig here until I find oil. That's all. I stocked up on lemons and limes at the oasis, so I should last a few days. I must find that oil. The long dig. I am digging for oil now, and my hand shakes as I write these, perhaps final, words. You know, you know he's dying because he, he put the ellipses in there. I have been digging from sunup to sundown, but still no sign of that sweet crude. Maybe I've just picked a dry spot in this cursed spot, in this cursed desert. But I'm sure this is where more lovely told me to dig. Yes, I'm sure of it. There's no more food or water, and even my hopes have dwindled to nothing. Ah, this is it. My dream dies here with me under these unforgiving skies. My dream. My... My? Wait, no. This is not it. My dream is of something else. Yes. Something else. Dig. Keep digging. I must keep Digging. Arms. Move. Body. Work. Find. Oil. The wrap-up. I am now on a boat back to Deer Rogueport. I did it. I finally struck oil in that dry desert. I have left the day-to-day -day operation to my men in the field and now return home. It all came true. Striking it rich. Finding oil. My dream. But somewhere along the way, this became more than just my dream. So many people have helped to make this dream happen. So many. You had nothing to give, but you got something nice anyway, dear Maustafa. I just want to believe in every dream this sad world can muster. Ah, uh, Colorado. People who lent me money, and gave me food, and showed me the way. So many hands reaching out to help me. I must do something for all of them. That feeling has pushed me even harder. I must share this feeling with the people who helped me as I struggled. I must share these words that have seared themselves into my heart. Dreams come true, Lumpy. Well, that's nice. That's nice. Okay, anyway, now we can go to the Thousand Year Door and actually, you know, do stuff. Do stuff that matters. I'm trying to- I was just trying to think, like, what's the quickest way to the door? Do I have anything in my inventory I need to get rid of before I do that? I don't have, like, a whack-a-bump, do I? No. Okay. Okay. Wait, do I have, a? Uh... Can I level these guys up? Have I done that yet? Do I have enough? Yo, oh, yeah, I got, I got tons. I got tons. Yeah, level this guy. Is 
There's also that shine sprite in, uh, or was it a shine sprite? I don't know. In, uh, the Bogley tree that I still need to get. But it's really out of the way. Okay, and I'll do flurry too. Mm, poor choice of words, I suppose. <laughs> Okay. Okay. Now to the door. Oh, little bit of lag. Little tiny bit of lag. Just a little bit as a treat. I never get tired of listening to this. Ah, Koopa cool Patrol! There's another really good song coming up, though. I don't know why I did that. Show me... Show me the moon! moon hits the sky like a big pizza pie that's amore when <laughs> when an eel lunges out and it takes a bite of your snout that's amore hmm is that right according to the map the last crystal star is it can't be I mean, Mario's been to the moon before. He'll be to he'll be to the moon again. <clears throat> if what this map indicates is true, the location of the final crystal star is the moon. The moon? Isn't Princess Peach also on the moon? Hmm. <clears throat> the problem here. Is how does one get to the moon? Why the conundrum? Give me a moment to look into this. Excuse me, please. This shouldn't take long. It's actually kind of chilly in here, so I'm going to turn this fan off. Hmm. <clears throat> Looking into this may take a little time, so come back in a bit, all right? Uh, whatever you say, Doc. Oh, zip toad. What's up, super sleuth? I heard you uncovered my imposter. You're the best man, seriously. See, when you get to be as big a star as Zip Toad, these sorts of things happen all the time. It's the biz. But man alive, for a no-name like you to brave danger and find my imposter... <laughs> ...reminds me of a younger yet less successful me. <laughs> Verified. <laughs> yeah, he has the little... ...Twitter tick next to his name. Except that doesn't mean anything anymore. It means you got eight dollars. <laughs> yeah, so as for me, I went to Toad Town to film my next leading role. The soon to be hit film on Golden Toad 2. It'll be huge. I hear you're on an adventure or something, so I'll leave you with a line from my last flick, The Toad Warrior. You're cool, baby, but I'm cooler. Best of luck, kid. All right, you done? Done yet? I'll have to wait outside for another two minutes. Oh, okay. So is, it, is it really just gonna make me wait? 
Or is there something I'm supposed to be doing? I mean, we could cook something for a second if we wanted to. Got, uh... I mean, we've already cooked the syrup. We, we got the omelet meal. What could we cook? We could cook something. Yeah, there's the... The flour and the leaf makes a salad, I think. Now, now, I know there's a way to get, like, a horse tail. And I need that for something. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's just, uh, giving me the other area. Because I need to get back there real quick. So yeah, it was here with, like, one of the hills, I think. And I think I can... Isn't this where you also get, like, Koopa grass? Or whatever. Hey, how you doing? Oh, oh, secret partner. Secret partner. Oh, yeah, there it is. Tur Turtly leaf. I do not have any room for this. Can I come back and get another one? Well, I mean, I guess we're gonna find out. Hey, kid, what are you up? What are you up to? I've been playing Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door a lot lately. Up. Oh. How does that work? I wasn't sure at first, but that game is awesome. I just beat it every chapter. Totally cool ending. I loved it. So worth the money. Think there will be a sequel? I mean, technically, yes, there was. If not, I hope they make a Paper Luigi game. Yeah, that'd be awesome, too. Does does he know? Okay, he just says that again. I just want to see if he had anything else. I, I think they added a new line for him in the remake. But I, I won't spoil what it is. Oh, I'm running out of space to store things. I, yeah, I gotta, I gotta cook. Jesse. Or I need to, you know, use items. Like I need to actually use items. You know, if I, I should probably have done at least some of the pit so I could get a bigger inventory, but I didn't. And that is where we're at right now. Okay, now please, let me- let me get another leaf. I need it. <laughs> yeah, I appreciate that they actually, like, put Waluigi- Ah! No, wait, there we go. They actually put Waluigi as hit- you know, as a combination. As a thing you can do. Okay, now... One of the hills. Is it you? No? How about you? How about you? Is it you? No? Leave me alone! Leave me alone! Is it- Oh wait, are these- are these the- Oh! Oh! Kill him. What, what do I do? What do I do? I mean, they don't all do that, right? No, it's just that one. Oh, hello, integer. So, so what do I do? How do I get- how do I get- oh, there we go! There we go. There we go. I forgot what I needed that in, but it's good to have. I- 
I never get tired of listening to this song either. I don't know, maybe I just have some kind of like really intense nostalgia, but it just, I don't know, it makes me very happy. This game has very nostalgia-able music. Well, I'm, I'm glad that you like what you have seen. Oh yeah, I also just think that it's really good, but you know. Wait, I need a... a fire flower, right? Like, fire flower plus leaf for like a salad. I, I hate that they added the animations for hitting them with the hammer. Because it's a cool detail, but I feel bad every single time. <laughs> a fire flower... Turtley leaf. Oh. Uh, I must- uh, I guess I misremembered. Now, what- what did the horse- what was the horse? A horse is a horse. Hmm, pardon me. Oh, okay, peach tart, right? No, oh, no. I should have been using the D-pad, that was my mistake. Oh, it was the- the horse! It was the horse! <laughs> oh well. You know what, next time I'm in the area... Oh, I can't store anymore. You know what, I'll just- I'll just use the mistake and get it out of my inventory. Yeah, eat your nasty food, Mario. You know what, let's just let's get one of the mysteries. And then we'll store the horse tail. Next time we're back in Petal Meadows, we'll we'll make that salad. I don't know if like I I honestly haven't decided if I'm gonna go through and like try to make all the recipes. I don't know. I mean probably on my own time. The question is just like stream, you know? As always. Okay, you done yet? You done yet, lad? Oh, excellent timing. I finally have it, Mario. I found a way that might just get you to the moon. You must go to Far Outpost, and you use the cannon there, and it will blast you. Whoa, we're using a cannon to blast ourselves to the moon? Yeah, extreme! I know it sounds really... Uh, I know how it sounds, really. To be honest, I'm not entirely sure of all the details. Accounts from Far Outposts speak of a device that can launch anything anywhere. Even to the moon. This is gonna be so cool! Just point the way. Where is this Far Outpost? I believe there's a pipe to Far Outpost somewhere beneath Rogueport. But I'm not sure of the exact location. Yes, I believe it was hidden for some reason. If my information is correct, you might need something called an Ultra Hammer to get it. An Ultra Hammer? Hey, right on, we already got one of those. Yeah, we're way ahead of you, Doc. Ah, oh, well, I see. That certainly changes the subject now, doesn't it? Well, use that Ultra Hammer to find the post- the post to pipe outpost. Outpipe. Get to it! Yeah, you got it, Prof. Far Outpost, charge! Oh yes, one more thing you should be aware of. The ball bombs who live there are sort of a surly bunch. They may not let you use that cannon, and you may have to negotiate with them. In any case, that's your problem. Good luck, get that last crystal star. 
not my problem. Also, I realize that Yoshi is really getting his lion's share of the dialogue. But I, I can't help it, he moves fast. He moves fast, so he's a good partner to have on you. But I have a feeling that in Far Outpost, Vivian will get a moment to shine if you catch my drift. But yes, we've, we've already ac accidentally wandered upon this. Chapter 7, Mario Shoots the Moon! That, it's that picture of that guy pointing a pistol at the sun. But yes, now we're in Snow World. Is this real? Like the picture? Yeah. This slowly falling snow is totally beautiful, but it's super, super cold out here. If I lived here long enough, I'd probably turn into an abdominable doodable Goomba. Oh, is there something back here? No? Oh, there's this. Oh. <laughs> okay, but yeah, let's get let's get Vivian out. She's got fire. This is Ice World. It don't take a genius. Oh wait, I didn't even think about hitting the tree. Okay. I like that we have scientifically devised how to compose cold music. Oh, but wait, I just realized. I got a tattle. I see that. I see that. Uh oh, he's he's got a thingy. That's an ice puff. It's a mean snow cloud that appears in cold areas. It swoops down and uses cold breath to attack. Trust me, it is not refreshing. That cold breath can freeze us, so try to avoid it. Also, if we touch it when it's storing cold energy, we'll get hurt. Isn't that super weak? And it gets worse. It'll absorb any ice attacks we throw at it. Yeah, yeah. They're vulnerable to fire, so let's try that, maybe. Okay, so swab her out for Viv. Oh, this battle theme's pretty good. That's not gonna work. Yeah. Not, not gonna work with the ice, man. Okay, well, that's not fun. That is not fun. I'm sorry, Vivian. <laughs> Don't worry, I will, I will switch. I will switch you around. Ooh. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, I messed that up. Yes, weakness. Oh, oh, I, I saw... I saw the timing. Yes! Eat flaming doo-doo. I forgot I had that on. Okay, there it is. Okay, now Goomb. What do you got to say about this place? Say, hey Mario, did you know walking in the snow leaves really cool footprints? Thing is, the snow's fallen so hard, they totally disappear quickly. 
Absolutely riveting, Boombella. Thank you. I mean, I don't know what I'd say either. Like, I I don't know, Mario. It's more it's more freaking snow. What do you want me to say? <laughs> okay. So. Yeah, I'm pressing that too early. It, that's- it's a lot of buttons to press, well... It's one button, but you know... Many, many times in a row. Oh- oh, I missed that! I'm gonna be saying that a lot now that I have this badge on. The recent chat widget seems to have ceased updating. Ah, cool. I say, and then it fixes. Yeah, it seems a little... spotty at times. I, I don't know. Uh, integer, say some. Say, say some words. I want to see if it has favoritism. Okay, no, it worked that time, so no, no, no favoritism. It's just sometimes it don't work, I don't know. Maybe I can fix that, maybe I can't. No, I, I can't, I can't put Vivian through that. Ooh. I didn't know it hit enemies behind it. That is interdasting. That's a Frost Piranha. It's a cool customer with strong ice powers. Its frozen breath attack can freeze us, so try to immobilize it first. It's weak against fire attacks too, so use them as well. That said, don't even think about using ice attacks. It'll absorb those. Yeah, I know. I, I know. I know type effectiveness. Ooh, got both of us. Oh, got one of us. Okay, now bring back the Viv. Bring back the Viv. You know what? I got Thunder Rage and just use it. I got too many items. Oh, but I'm... I can't tell what that is. That was a rock. Okay. <laughs> but she dodged it just in time. Hello, Zeej. I, I missed the t I mean, it doesn't even matter. It doesn't even matter because, like, my bar is full. Oh, I'm so full of star power, yum. Die! <laughs> yeah, you don't give me that time. So what did I- what did I get? Sh oh yeah, showstopper. Showstopper. Well, I'll use this, cause, you know. Sweet feast. So yeah, it's basically the- the better version of that other one that we had before. So there's no reason to use that one now, unless we got no star power at all. That, oh yeah, that is a meaty- that is a meaty life. Meaty FP.
Oh, I pushed it just, just a little too late. Just a little bit too late. Uh, uh, no, that is a, that is a super guard. Th that's a super guard right there. That cloud's gonna die from fire. He died. He literally died in a fire. God bless. Yes, thank you. Hit a bunch of trees. See what is these. Ha ha! Can I use a uh, art attack? No, I can't. I need one more for that. You know, we'll just, we'll use Ultra Hammer. Super Toilet. Speaking of, apparently that new Fairly Odd Parent show is actually kind of not awful. Which is, I missed it again! Because I was too busy thinking about Super Toilet. No longer, though. Okay, but I'm, I'm gonna need... Oh, I need more FP. And by that, I mean Vivian needs more FP. You know what would be funny? If you could stylish using an item. No, I did- I missed it again! No- <laughs> I forgot the context about Super Toilet. Yes! Uh, the context was that there was no context. <laughs> it- the, like, the whole joke was that it was- it was something that happened off-screen. <laughs> and Cosmo was really traumatized by it. Oh, okay. I, I don't really need that right now, but... Close to a level. Yeah, we're gonna get a level out of this. Oh. Like, like, they were using it as an example of why Timmy wishing for super things is a bad idea. But I mean, I mean, there's not a single wish in that show that does not go awry. Mostly because, you know, they need it to. They need for there to be something that goes awry. Because otherwise, there's not a TV show. <laughs> you know, we gotta get that bag. Okay, so what do we got? Ooh, that would be good for here. E? Here we go. Far outpost. You get it? Like, far out? So this is Far Outpost. Where do you think they keep that cannon of theirs? Well, only one way to find out. Let's get started by talking to the villagers. And if I remember correctly, they're gonna have me do a real fun voice for this one. Welcome to Far Outpost. Whoa, that is quite good lip warmer you have got. Okay, I now give you my special mustache viewing personality analysis, yes. Ah, hmm, yes, yes, hmm, yes, yes, I have got it now. Your bushy broom means that you're a stubborn and selfish man. How did I know? I have certain experience with mustaches like that, you see. This is Bob-Bomb Village, Dablui. 
There is nothing here, Dablamo. As you can guess from my Kablami reserved demeanor, mini bombs only open up to other bombs. Racism. Hello, traveler. First time in a far outpost, Kabui? What? Far outpost cannon? Wow, I apologize for that. No, I just had distraction. It is nothing. Kapawi. <laughs> Snow is rare for you, Bakak. In Far Outpost, it falls all year round, Babang. I like watching it shine in glow of sunset, Baboomer. Is there a star piece around here? Not that I see. Not that I see. We are the Chili Wanderers, the Traveling Sisters 3. We came to Far Outpost for the skiing and ice skating, but there's nothing here. It's cold. It's too cold. I told you we should have at least checked the guidebook before we came here. I make big snowball today. Maybe I am as big as him someday, Papawi. But I do not want the melting to happen to me, Papum. You know, you might not believe it, but that actually foreshadows something in Sticker Star. Which I guess is technically a spoiler, I apologize. There's not much to spoil in that game, but that's one of the things. Snowmen, igloo, snow fights, yes, all good. But snow gets boring sometimes, chaboom. I forgot to put Discord on Do Not Disturb mode. Ah, mi de la mustache. I have tried too many times to talk to the girl in the inn and she kicked me out. C'est incroyable. So now I must use the heat of my feelings for her to melt the snow. Ah, ah, achoo! I gotta, I gotta hear Goombella's tattle on him though. You gotta hand it to this guy to come out to even this forsaken place. Talk about totally tenacious. This dude is serious. Honestly, I, I- there was one of them I missed, one of the Dupree tattles, and I think it might have been my favorite in the game, which is kind of unfortunate. Oh yeah, that's the- oh, pink. Pink. Okay, ooh, shooting star. Ruin powder. You know what, yeah, I'll take a shooting star. Oh, oh. Love the noise that Vivian makes when she walks around or floats around or whatever. Yes, what business do you have here? What? A cannon? No such thing is here. What? But we definitely heard there was definitely a cannon. <laughs> What do you want me to say? We do not have one. What? Did I not tell you we have no silly cannon? <laughs> I like this guy. I know nothing, Shablui. I know nothing about local cannon lovingly nicknamed Big Bob <laughs> Shashum. Yes, there is no such thing in this village. What, what's in here? Uh, nothing. I mean, it's just- it's just somebody's house. It is so peaceful, Waboom. Far Outpost is nice, restful place, Waploom. Looking at night sky makes me feel vastness of space. Lots of space, Waboom. What, did I not tell you we have no silly cannon? But yeah, there's there's a big ol... Oh, thank you. There's a big ol' cannon statue right here. Right here.
Okay, do I just- do I have to leave? Cause I know- I know this is one of the parts that gets a little criticized for padding. And you will- you will absolutely see why. Yeah, you're right. That seems like a very normal cannon to me. Oh. Okay, well, I probably need to... ...get Viv back out. But I do have Fire Hammer. Oh, wait. What? What? I'm sorry, I, I- I did not quite understand that. Yes, I did it! Yes, I did it! Okay, let me- let me try that again. Oh. Okay, yeah, I- I'm gonna need to practice that. Because <laughs> I'm not sure what's going on. Don't worry, Vivian, he's dead. Oh yeah, big money, big prizes. I love it. Got a wob and beave. Mm, might as well save. Might as well jump. I mean, that's kind of what this guy does. No, 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 no. Well, I mean, go back to Frankly, tell him there's no cannon. Rumors of cannon were greatly exaggerated. But first, I got another Shine Sprite, so let's upgrade our dude. Okay, power up the Viv. And we're very close to having everybody at max level, so that's good. The game is approaching the end, and I think I have called Naka, Naka a total of maybe four times. Oh, okay. Well, okay, that wasn't the answer, so I just- I ran back here for no reason at all. Oh, wait, I got- I got a bomb. bomb One of my dudes is a bomb. bomb <laughs> In my defense, this game usually doesn't require you to pull out a specific partner to do things. Or, I mean, with NPCs, at least. I, I legitimately thought you had to go back to Frankly, tell him there's no cannon, and then he'd be like, 
Uh, no, there almost certainly is a cannon. And then you'd come back here and he's like, well, wh one of us is lying. <sighs> one tells lies, the other tells the truth. How can you escape our dungeon? Okay, so I am once again out of FP. <laughs> I got infatuate now. No, you don't. But yeah, I gotta- I gotta figure out the freaking... Fire hammer. Oh, you gotta- oh, you hit the fireball. You have to time it to hit the fireball. You know... Listen, you guys are going to groan. You guys are gonna think I'm the biggest idiot on the face of the planet, and you're going to be absolutely right. I didn't see the fireball falling until just now. Literally did not see it. Just completely blinded that. <sighs> okay. So yeah, we gotta bring out... ...this guy. Oh, no way, I, I thought he might say something different. Yeah, I'm not- this is not a good session so far. Not a good session at all. Hang on, I kinda need to buy more syrup. Do they have syrup in here? Yeah, they do, okay. And I need to use one of them right now. You know, I- I'm willing to bet you that in the GameCube version that might have been a lot more visible. Now listen here! You're the mayor, hmm? How can an official like you lie that way? Old boy, I know I saw a cannon the last time I was here, so do not lie, sir. Shush! You call yourself a babom? I spit at you! You know rules. There is to be no mention of cannon to non bombs No mention! We must not allow it to be used for evil. Of course I know all that, you great blowhard. But we must use that cannon to get to the moon, old boy. And if we don't, sir, the world could end. Hmm. Oh, world could end. Hmm. Well, we cannot have that now. Still, you cannot use cannon right now because of certain, uh... Circumstances. Circumstances? We must have permission of Goldbob to use cannon. He's the one who started the whole blasting things to faraway places policy. Once he got rich, he let business slide and does not start it up again. Also, General White who was one who devoted himself to operation of cannon. But he was so depressed by losing of job that he took cannon key and ran off to some settlement far, far away. Old Bob and General White? Yes, that is correct. If you want to use cannon, you must find Gold Bob and General White. Very well then. You can't give up now, old boy. Mario, the search is on. Let's go find those two Bobs. Well, once you find them, come back and talk to me. Okay, so now... Now we go back. This might be a long chapter. This might be a two-stream chapter. I mean, I'm not complaining. I'm in no hurry for this game to be over. It's honestly kind of a little sad that it almost is. But, you know... All things must come to an end one day.
But that does really good damage. That's some good experience, though. I mean, I, it cost me, like, 10 FP to get it, but... Yeah, that's the one thing about that strategy, is it's kind of... It's very expensive, Douglas. Yeah. I mean, we could put some badges on to, like, lower the FP cost if we needed to. Ah! Ow. I mean, might as well be using my moves. Like I said, I got these moves. Might as well be using them. I mean, it still worked. Oh no! I pressed the button just slightly too late. And now Vivian is frozen. And... Everything is... Everything is ruined. Can I go past you? Yeah, I can. Okay. Oh yeah, stylish has nothing to do with whether or not you actually hit the action command. You just need to- <laughs> You just need to look cool while you're doing it. <laughs> you can whiff it, you just gotta look cool. I- I really do not need this. Like, like, that was supremely overkill. The most overkill anything's ever been overkilled. Well, okay, that's not true. Well, you know, it was pretty overkill. Oh. Oh! Oh. But it's called- it's called Fire Drive, like you're- like you're- like it's golf. Like, that kind of drive. But, I mean, Mario's never golfed before, so why would I- why would I believe that that was a thing that you should be doing? Ah, oh, yes. I do the fancy spin. I style on him. And he is so... He's so embarrassed that he cannot help but die. There we go. That's a good thing. But, um, oh man, I, I've said it before, but... The best thing that Modern Paper Mario gave to this series is the multiple battle themes. I mean, there are already multiple battle themes, but one per chapter. Like, the chapter specific. And I'm glad that that is now in a game that I enjoy much more. <laughs> True, go buy a copy of Mario Golf for the N64 and boot it up. Mario ain't there. Wh what are you talking about? Like, that game's just called Golf. You know, ironically, there is a game called Golf on the NES and Mario is there. <laughs> or at least someone with a striking resemblance to Mario. Okay, so... I know exactly where this dude is. Oh, it should not take too long for me to get my hands on him. Uh, 
And this is actually why I did not bother to go back and get the leaf again. Because I know that <laughs> General White is here. If you remember. If you remember from chapter one, he is here. Or at least he was here. Let, we'll have to see if he's still here. Hang on, Vivian. Can you like, can you like hang off the edge a little bit? No, no, Viv, Viv, Viv. I mean, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. There we go. So this is like the town gate. And he was, uh, over here. No way, he was he was to the left, wasn't he? Yeah. You got anything new to say? No, it's it's still the Paper Mario Thousand Year Door. The Paper Mario, the Thousand Year Door game. No wait, no, he was over there. I thought that that was that guy's house, but then I guess I didn't see any peach stuff there. So I need to I need to ask about where this man went to. <laughs> yeah, just dementia. Okay, no. No, that's the same thing. Where was where's General White? Mayor. Mayor. Mayor, where's General White? Oh, if it isn't Murphy. Eh, what's that you see? General White? Hmm, General? Hmm, well, I'm certain I've seen him, but he doesn't seem to be around now. I think he may have possibly said he might head south to a more tropical locale. Creaky Key? Was that it? Yep, that's it. That might possibly, perhaps, could be it. Well, honestly, that's alright, because I also needed to go there. Cause I gotta give old Wack uh, another namesake. Yeah, this this little hub speeds things up considerably. I gotta get the Yoshi to run Cause this place is real big Smack But I don't know what to do with that cause my storage is full General what? Yeah, he was here until a second ago. And he took off right quick. Said he was going to a city with floats in the sky or something. <laughs> yeah, they just... You just gotta go all over the place for this guy. Pardon me. Oh, uh, oh, hey, look at that guy. The guy with the business account. <laughs> oh, this is no good. No one will solve my trouble. Oh, well, don't worry. We'll, we'll get back on that at some point. 
Well, I'm not coming back yet. Welcome back, Gonzalez. Everyone's been all a Twitter waiting for your return. We missed all your fabulous moves. General Line? Oh, you must mean that white babam, huh? Yeah, he used to come here all the time. But I haven't seen him lately. Now that I think about it, I think he headed off to some huge tree. Or not. Well, it, it gives me a good excuse. Like I said, it gives me a good excuse to clean up a few odds and ends that I've been dealing with. That I've been waiting to do. You know, just in case you forgot where we've been. Welcome to the Great Tree. Eh? General White? Yeah, he's an old bob with this great mustache. But I have no idea where he went. He may have said he was going somewhere dark. Okay, but while we're here, I would like to, uh, find that one block that I've been meaning to get. Because, you know, I'm here. I'm in the area. You know, I just... I was in town, thought I'd swing by. This is definitely one of the best looking areas in the remake. It just, it, it complements the design of this place rather well. It, it was like... Maybe not this? Oh. <laughs> Shouldn't I be, like, slaughtering these guys? Do I have that badge on right now? Twilight Town also looks really good in the remake. Indeed it does. Indeed it does. I miss both of the stylishes for him. Yeah, one, one, one point. Hang on, do I have that badge on right now? What is it? What is the name of that badge? I got two fire drives. Does that mean I can use super fire? Where is that? Do, do I have it on? Yeah. Oh, if it if it's a first strike. Okay. Okay. I forgot about that. I forgot about that little detail. No. No. See, I'm used to Earthbound, where it's just like, yeah, you just you just kill him. You just freaking kill him. Yeah, so it's in here somewhere. Right there, right there. Okay. Did it... What, did it pop up up there? This had better be good. What? Oh, it was an invisible block the whole time. I swear I thought I tried that. Oh well. Better Nate than Lever. Yeah, there we go. That's what you want to see. That's what we need, Kong. Speaking of Donkey Kong 64, <laughs> I was talking in the Geek Critique server uh, yesterday about Donkey Kong 64, and I like posted my old tweet of me beating the game in 2015. 
I was like 18 years old. <laughs> and Josh retweeted it, and I swear, like... It's gotten more likes in 2024 than it's got- than it ever got in 2015. Including, uh... Including She Says and, uh... Cyber Shell for some reason. They're just like, all right, guy, I don't know. Congratulations on 100%ing Donkey Kong 64 a decade ago. And you know what the sick thing is? You want to know? You want to know what the sick thing is? Is that I'll probably do it again. I, I will probably 100% Donkey Kong 64 at least once more before I die. Now, who would... Uh, General White? Yeah, I know that old guy. He's a white bomb right? He was here until recently. What? Where did he go? What am I, his secretary? He just looked tired and kept mumbling about a cannon. Where was the- where's the pipe? Oh, there it is. I, <laughs> Sometimes my short-term memory is not so good. <laughs> not so good. Okay, but we also need to get the gold bob man. And we know that he is here. Oh yes, Porcelain Heights. Oh yes, I keep burping because I drank... I'm drinking carbonated Dr. Pepper. <laughs> Good day, Dude Gonzalez. What can I do for you today? What's that you say? You must use the cannon in Far Outpost to save the world? Hmm, well that is rather a pickle, isn't it? Very well then, I certainly owe you a favor to, hmm? Yes, I should say. The truth is, I'd have hoped to resume my business with that cannon someday. And just between us, I only stopped because the wife said she didn't like the noise. Sadly, it takes a hefty bit of coin to get that cannon working, so... I need you to demonstrate just how much you want to use that cannon. Uh... One coin. One coin? Do you mock me? Why not just slam me with your shoe and be done? This will not do, no, no. Why don't you come back later with a new attitude? Sixty-four coins. You seem to be underestimating the value of my services. I... I really do not want to give this man all my money. What if I... what if I bring Bobbery out here? Hmm. I mean, there's no bank system in this game. Let me see, is there... I'm gonna go to... I'm gonna go Google. Is there a way to not have Gold Bob rob me in broad daylight? Bob Daylight. Don't give Gold Bob all your money. <laughs> Oh, okay. There, there's no way around it. What? You'd pay every coin you have. All of them. You, uh, really? So, really? 
Well, I suppose I'm just surprised to hear you say that. Staggered, actually. You know that means you'll be left with zero coins, with absolutely nothing. You know that, do you? I mean, think of it, man. If you spent all your coins, and I mean all of them, you would certainly face a great deal of difficulty down the road. But hold on. I want to make sure you're doing this fully aware of the consequences. Are you sure you won't regret this later? Absolutely sure. You won't say just kidding later on, or any sort of tomfoolery like that? I can really take them all, really. All right, then. Mm, well, you've certainly shown me something, sir. So, I give my permission for you to activate the Far Outpost Cannon. Oh, and I wasn't serious earlier, my dear fellow. How could I take your money? <laughs> it's a shame, I suppose, but I'll return your money. Now soldier on, my boy! Yeah, so... <laughs> I, I read that he gives it back to you, but... You, you can understand why I didn't want to take such a risk. An unknown businessman was taken into custody today by port authorities as he tried to board the blimp carrying large amounts of a volatile red liquid. After a few tense moments, authorities identified the liquid as a spicy condiment, and the businessman was subsequently released. Our RDM reporters were mystified by the following unsolicited comment. Buy our new hot sauce, folks! Oh, the shop on the Excess Express. Oh, okay, well, I guess we're going shopping. Ink pasta. Fresh pasta and inky sauce. Oh, semi-final issue. Well, we'll go into the shop real quick. So, fun fact, this is the only regular Yoshi in the game. <laughs> what do you gotta say? That's a passenger on the XS Express. Not to change the subject, but watching your health abroad is super important. You wouldn't want to get sick and spoil the whole trip, would you? Not even gonna mention that it's a Yoshi. Which you prefer, curry or stew? Sorry, I guess that's a weird question to ask. Anyway, me, I like curry. Took a while, but that's the conclusion I've come to. Okay, so we'll, we'll buy a couple items while we're here. Oh, I might be in a- I might be in a pickle. I might be in a pickle. Well, you know what? I, I got some health that I need to restore. Anybody else? I mean, Vivian. Now I got full FP. If I need to cook this. I mean, I might only be able to buy one thing. <laughs> Uh, give me lightning. Oh, I'm so close to 60, though. I got too many items. There's too many items in this game and not enough storage. You know, I got I could sell something. I mean, I'm just here for the points, let's be real. Uh, I'll get rid of the maple syrup. I, I know I just bought it, but I'll get I'll get rid of it because I want to want to take advantage of the points. 
You know what? We'll just buy it right back. You ever actually make use of the end coupons? Sometimes. Sometimes. We're basically just paying coins to get points. We're gaming the economy. And uh, I'll do it like one more time. There we go. Okay. So now, now how do I actually like stop being on this train? Do I have to go to bed? Okay. Yeah, you just rest till Rogueport. Mario slept for three consecutive days. Ain't that the dream? No pun intended. And I honestly did not need to use the items, but like I said, I was in it. I was in it for the points. Go in the door, Mario, I swear to God. Okay, now back to Far Outpost, I suppose. Hey, Duichi. Somebody could experience some interesting dreams being asleep that long. Speaking of dreams, uh, like I said in Club Saturn, I had the CRT with component inputs dream again. It's it's honestly driving me insane. I keep dreaming of going into a thrift store and finding like five CRTs with like component inputs, but I never actually get one in real life. Hang on, I want to... I want to do something. I'm I'm going to go I'm actually going to go glass cannon for a little bit. Cuz I I have a strategy. Okay, so... I wonder if you'd still have that dream after acquiring one. Oh man. I'm so close. Hang on, is there anything... Uh, I kind of want to keep that, but... I mean, I'll get rid of it if if need be. You know what, let me, let me get rid of this for right now. Like I said, I'm trying a bold... I'm trying a bold new strategy. Oh wait, I still have two. I still have two that I could use on something. And we'll put that on, why not? WHY NOT?! You! Is this the so-called Great Gonzalez? Uh, well, it's me, your worst nightmare. The new and improved Rock Hawk. Don't forget, I think I forgot you, punk. I'm reborn, you coward. My training regimen could blow your mind. And I'm on the fast track back to the top, and ain't nobody gonna get in my way. Rock! And still, on rainy days, I feel the bruises of your hammer of shame left on this bod. And I feel the rage again. If you ever show your face in the ring again, I'll beat you so bad your mama won't even recognize you. Remember the rock. Yeah, I don't even have a CRT with with S video. Like I I only ever had composite. Ah! 
I mean, I meant to get into a battle, but I was hoping to first strike him. Okay, now let's see. How, how effective is this? Wait, why can't I... Oh, wait, they gotta be on the ground for that. Yes, do it. Oh, this is too early. I mean, now I don't even need to do it. Now it's, like, honestly too late. Money, money. Money, honey. Ah! Okay, they're on the ground. They're on the ground. So I can see eight, eight freaking FP for this. That is a lot of damage, though. It's a lot of damage. I'm close to another level. I'm close to another bingo. I'm close to many things, truly. There you go. You know what, I'm gonna just use Art Attack on this guy. There you go. That's the stuff. Ten more. Ten more, and I am... I can get even more bag. I will have more bag than previously thought possible. Mankind is not prepared for what I have in store. That's cool. Oh, oh, I... I done did it. <laughs> or rather, I didn't do it. Okay, goodbye. Yeah, I think it'll be two battles. I don't think we're getting it this time, but we are close. My finger slipped off the button. Oh no, we got it, we got it. And you know there is only one answer to this question. Mario became an A-list star. Next battle, Mario's crowd and stage get even bigger. Wow. My inventory is full. My inventory is full. I should have actually cooked the thing before I came here. Oh, I miss it! I am a fool! Nope, die.
Actually, yeah, I, I think I might want to go back to Rogueport and cook this thing. Free up some inventory. Because I don't, I don't want to go to the moon with all this. Yeah! Right after my shine sprite, too. Yeah, you know what? I'm glad you died in a fire. You know what? Let me, let me get on Yoshi. Just a quick little bit of cooking. And then we'll we'll actually proceed. No. No. Oh, it looked like your hammer hit me. It looked like it. But it didn't. You just cracked it. Okay. The horse tail. Where's the horse tail? Oh wait, that's still in storage! Fudge! Which means I'm gonna have to sell something because I don't have any... I don't have any room to juggle. I'm gonna have to sell my... my maple syrup again. No, you know what? We'll just... we'll just use the end coupon. We'll use the end coupon. We'll sleep it off. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. Okay! Oh wait, there it was. Horsetail. Oh wait, I got the peachy peach too. What was- What was I supposed to combine that- Cake mix, cake mix. Peachy peach and cake mix. Wonder if I have enough points to get another cake mix. Okay, turtly leaf, horse tail. Salad. Fifteen FP. Very nice. Okay, let, let me see if I can get a cake mix real quick. I forgot, why is this toad so salty all the time? Uh, partially because I stepped on her contact lens. Oh, hey, dude. Hey, it's you again. I'm my Francesca and her Frankie doing, eh? Bah, I'm sure you got nothing to worry about, but I just figured I'd ask. Yeah, I, I got enough for cake mix. What? Wait, what else do we got? I mean, you can get a gold bar. I mean, that's that and cake mix are really the best prizes in here. But now my inventory's full again, so I gotta I gotta put something in so I can get the peach out.
Okay, store. I mean, yeah, this sure is a store. Uh, what, what could I put? I'll put the Ultra Mushroom in there. Peach, 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 peach. I bet you you can make a coconut cake. That seems like a thing that you should be able to do. Hey, you know what, what, what the heck? We'll, we'll, after we cook this, we'll go back, get one more cake mix, we'll give it a try, and then we'll, we'll, then we'll proceed. Okay, so, peach, peach, cake mix. Oh, that looks scrumptious. Random status effect, I guess. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. One last time, one last time. Like I said, this is probably gonna be a two-stream chapter, because we haven't even gotten to the moon yet. And I mean, I, I feel like that still would be the case, even if I weren't making all these detours. Detours! You know, an episode of that, like, Star Wars Detours leaked. <laughs> leaked on the internet at some point, and I, I haven't watched it. I, I know, contain your sh contain your shock. And just put the- just put the Ultra Mushroom in there. Withdraw. Uh, where's the coconut? Where is the coconut? There it is. Okay. Moment of truth. Coconut cake. I have completely exited from Star Wars media. You know, from the sound of things... Understandable. I mean, I know people said the Mandalorian was good. The Mandalon. Okay, not what I was expecting, but, uh, still good. Not a failure. Have these people not heard of coconut cake before? Okay, now let me put the, the whack a bump in there. Okay, okay. Okay! Okay! Maybe that should be another, like, sound redeem. Is the metal slug. Okay! Of course, I probably need to actually stream metal slug. And I will, eventually. I'm ex just exhausted from all the new and extra stories that may or may not cause continuity weirdness. Yeah... D oh no! No! But yeah, when you got a series that big, it is kind of difficult to keep all your ducks in a row. Because you, you have like 400 million different people making Star Wars stuff. You know, this jump is weirdly tight. Or this flutter, whatever you want to call it. I should probably put another bag on. Because I got, I got the points to accommodate this. What could I do with that? Good use. Good just get, You know what? Let's get some more FP. We'll get, we'll get some more FP, because, you know, with badge, you can do anything. You can do anything you want to do. 
through badge, all things are possible, so jot that down. Uh-oh, that guy's got a stinky. Oh wait, was that, was that like pyrotechnics? Have I never gotten that before? Yeah, that was, that's, that's a lot of, a lot of damage. I felt like he's still gonna get to use his item though. Maybe I should have switched to Miss Mouse and steal it. Not that I have any room for it. Yes, death. Death to all of them. Okay. You know what, sure, whatever. Did literally didn't matter. Literally did not matter. Okay, give give me my money. Nope, no, nope, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Hey, I hit the button. I hit the button. You gotta believe me. I told you I hit the button, but you didn't believe me. Why didn't you believe me? Nope. 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 No, 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 no. Here we go. This is vaguely like Donkey Kong Country-esque music. Oh, you have permission to use cannon. Must mean you met up with Gold Bob. All that remains is General White. What? You cannot find the general? Hmm. Now where did he go? This makes trouble for us. We definitely need him. Otherwise we could not even operate that thing. So what to do? <laughs> Imagine we didn't notice that. Seems to be asleep. Wake him up? Yes. He's still asleep. Try again. He's still sound asleep. Try again. He's definitely still asleep. Try again. He's still sawing logs. Try again. I like that you have like the indicators. He couldn't be more asleep. Try again. He's counting sheep. Try again. He woke. Nah, he's still asleep. Try again. He's woke! Paper woke yo. Sleeping like a stashed baby. Try again. Not even budging. Try again. He's still snoring away. Try one more time. Ugh, north, snorf, north. Now, who are you? I'm tired. I do not need your attention. I just want to sleep, as it is all hopeless. Look! That mustache, that hat, and that hammer, even. Hut, hut! I've been looking everywhere for you! Why? Well, to bring Big Bob back online. I lost my life's work, my very reason to live. I found myself at wit's end, and then the rogue port fortune teller told me, seek the man with the M on his hat. 
The one with the hammer and stash, he will fulfill your dreams. Or something like that. So he was on... He was on a fetch quest for us. What? You need to use the cannon to help you save the entire world? Hip hip hurrah! That fortune teller was right! So what are we waiting for? I shall get Big Bob ready, so go tell the mayor. Now go get moving. Hut hut! I can't help but feel like we were the ones going around looking everywhere for him. What? General White is back? Then Big Bob's grand revival cannot be far behind. I will just explode with delight. Now let us shoot you guys to the moon. We did it, Mario. No, you follow me. Hurry on now, this way, this way. I am heavy weapons guy. And this is my weapon. Preparations are complete. Big Bob is fire ready. Hut, let's do this. Now you stand here. <laughs> General White, is Big Bob ready? Hut, leave it to me. Now men, you know the drill. Load Big Bob. Now positions everyone. Bring guidance system online. System check. S system check. All clear. Repair Big Bob's detonation sequence. Open outer hatch. Oh, he's a big boy. Is a big old boy. Open inner shutters. Oh wait, where's Mario then? There was a shutter in the way. Lift Big Bob into position. Acquire target, the moon! Directions 75.38, elevation 54.66, range 389,603. Wind speed 1.08, correct direction 3.03, .03, correct elevation 2.39. Target locked, now open the chamber hatch. Now everyone in! Whoa, a little laggy. Another one of those crowd scenes. Close chamber hatch. Conditions all green. Stand by. Okay. Okay! It is time! Big Bob Cannon. Fire! Good luck, Mario. Yeah. 
is she enjoying it? <laughs> well, here we are. Spice! Gee whiz, that was wild. Never thought I'd take a ride like that. Oh wait, how did you get to and from here? If if the X-Nauts have been on the moon this whole- you know, I don't- I don't know. Well, we're really on the moon, alright. Are you ready, Mario? Let's find the last crystal star and save Peach. Oh wait, actually, there might- there might actually be an answer to that question, but I won't spoil it. Low grav. <laughs> Love the comet in the background. Oh, do I- do I even have room for that? Yeah, I do actually, never mind. Oh, he doesn't jump high. Maybe higher than he normally does, I don't know. We're on the moon, awesome! The moon I always look up at, can you believe it? I mean, I heard they put a Goomba on the moon, but who know we'd get here? Boy, nothing's impossible on your adventure, most Mario. This is Mario. You're the coolest. Oh. Oh, wait. There is another... So we got two ways we can go from here. Okay, so I figure we'll we'll go a little bit more explore the moon a little bit oh, Hey cleft Oh, it's the rave That's a moon cleft. It's a basic cleft living on the moon. Fence is high as usual, and fire attacks don't work against it. If you can turn it over with an explosion, though, its defense goes down to zero. Okay, yeah, that'll actually help this time. Yep, yep. Suck it, nerd. Okie doke. Honestly, this reminds me of like a battle theme in Metopia. I gotta do the post game of Metopia at some point. No, no, no. No! Stop! Stop it! Stop it! Ow! Now you made me mad. And I get angry when I'm mad. Wait, I have an, I I have an item for this. Yeah, that's actually, that's actually perfect for this situation.
Bomb Squad. Okay, I might have messed that up. Luckily, these guys are like pathetically easy to super guard. I'm really glad I did not fail one of those, or else that would have been supremely embarrassing. Also, I could probably take off the fire drive now. That, that was an explosion! That was an explosion, you fart! I did not successfully super guard. Would you cut that out? Ah, nuts. Ah, nuts. But if nuts and butts were chocolates, a uh, Christmas would... Yeah. There's a lot of clefts up here. A lot of clefts. And just pushed him away a little bit. You know what? Well, we're gonna bring out the nuke. You remember... You remember Bombette and her nuke? Well, the nuke is back. And this time, it's better than ever. Okay, well, I mean, I need to see what's under that. No! Okay, fine. Fine. Ha hammer. I wanted to blow you up, but if you insist on a hammering, then what can I really say? Yeah, see? See what I mean? I say about nothing in particular. Oh, I forgot I forgot to be stylish, even though I really don't need to right now. Okay, blow that up. Ooh. Don't mind if I do! Oh wait, there's another one. I'm- I'm going to be out of inventory space, so maybe I- Maybe I should not blow up any more of these. Oh no! No, 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 no. 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 Yes! Die!
You know, maybe I should have used Art Attack. Something like that. Oh, the moon fell on me. This ain't Majora. This ain't even despicable me. Okay, Goombella, what you gotta say about right here? Boy, I guess they're pretty much just rocks on the moon. I guess I knew that, but it's still kind of disappointing. Lousy, boring moon. <laughs> oh, she's funny. We love her. Funny little baby. Oh boy, more of this. Stars sure are pretty here. I wonder if I can find my favorite constellation. I'm such a totally shameless m romantic, it's not even funny. I mean, there's only two of these guys. Yeah, you, whenever you do, whenever you do an explosion, it does a little hop. The moon does a little hop. Which is not a sentence anyone has ever said before, I'm sure. Dear God, why are there so many of these freaking things? I'm debating if I want to, like, kill them. Like, if I even want to bother. Stop it! Leave me alone! I know there's a star piece back here. No. No, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me leem leem leave me leave me alone. You got that? You got that Buster Boy Brown? Oh uh oh, oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. No, I'm not. Actually, I'm fine. There's a weird looking building off in the distance. Why would that be here? Uh oh, that's a that's a new thing. Not the new thing. Okay, we're we, we're gonna be back. We're gonna be back in a second. We'll be back. I'll be back. Just waiting for some indication that I am indeed back. Okay, I'm back. Okay, that's the Z-Yucks. It's a genetic, genetic improvement on the original Yucks. Multiple mini Z-Yucks will appear to protect the main unit, as you'd expect. Sometimes they also restore HP to the main unit, which really burns me up. It doesn't have much HP, but those barriers often protect it from attacks. Not if I kill it to death! 
Oh, we're, we are close to yet another level. I actually have money for once, which is crazy. Is there anybody I haven't had out in a little while? I mean, coops, but these are these are air dudes. You know what, Madam Flurry, Madam Flurry, help me kill this man. Oh, jeez. Well, that was the enemy that you could have done something about, Flurry. So never mind. Guess Bobbery's coming back out. Yeah, the the Twitch mobile app can be a little. Uh... I pushed the button! I mean, whatever. It's like one damage. Who even cares? Who even cares? Take it. Take the take the one damage. I don't care. SpongeBob could take a million damage! I, I see. I told you. I, to I done told it, did you. Yeah, don't don't think too hard about that. Don't think think too hard about the moon falling on you on the moon. But yeah, I want to level up. Give me my level up that I so crave and desire. Okay, now Flurry can do something. <laughs> That's the moon's moon. It, it just moons all the way down, really. Oh, come on. Come on, give me two points. Two points, two points, two points. <laughs> nope, your ring cannot kill me. I'm sorry, Lex Luthor. But there is naught you can do. The entire crowd is large pink bombs. I'm really popular with the large pink bomb demographic. This is my Twitch chat. No, it's not. It's not my Twitch chat because there's too many people. <laughs> but the people who are in my Twitch chat look like this. This is the, this is the ideal Twitch chat size, though. Is it flattering to be considered a big pink bob? I mean, you're not fat or anything, you're just big. And you're pink. Okay, badges. No, I thought I was gonna take off the fire drive. Uh. Boost Mario's defense. What do I got on? I'll keep the tornado on. TORNADO HOLD! Uh, okay, I got four. Spend on something. Hmm, good. Just get some more health, I guess. You know, could always just get some more health. Yeah, you know what? Just get some more health. Just get some more health, but then I'll still have one. So I need to... I need to use that for something. I need to use that for something. Hey, you know what? Sure, whatever. Whatever. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that this has got to be the Pipe Rock. Yes. Pipe Rock confirmed. Pipe Rock Galactic. Uh, 
Okay, anything over here? Anything over here? Nope. But they, they, I mean, they don't put an invisible wall. You can go over there. There's no reason to, but you can do it. Oh, you can go over here too. Nothing is stopping you. Nothing is stopping you. I can jump as tall as this building. Carl or Flea can't jump over the London Eye. Okay, so prepare for the best music you've ever heard in your life. Rather suspicious building, wouldn't you say, old boy? Do be careful, eh? And no, that wasn't sarcasm based on the fact there's no music yet. Who knew there'd be such a weird building on the moon? Almost unbelievable, actually. At least got a big glass dome to keep all the air from leaking out. What's that? Yeah, now that you mention it, I guess we were okay out there with no air to breathe. Yeah, I'd rather not think about that too much, I guess. Let's change the subject. I, I wasn't talking about this music. Who's that, dude? Whoa, that's Mario. So let's get him? Yeah, let's get him, dude. Well, I mean, after this battle, I guess. It's the dark man. I mean, anyone who's played this game before knows what music I'm, ta I'm talking about. That's an elite x naught This guy is the creme de la creme of the x naughts More Twitch chat? Is something weird going on? No? Okay. He'll use regular attacks as well as boosting his power or size. Oh, oh, the big pink bub bombs. Okay. I thought something was wrong with the embed. Elite x naughts are tough, but you'll just have to smack away till they go down. Ow! Ow! I thought for sure I was gonna be able to- okay. I thought I was gonna be able to super guard that. Yes! Complete and utter death! Nope. Nope. Super guarding. Not working. Not working. I'm doing it bad. You rapping bad. <laughs> yeah! Mario, if these X-Not dweebs are here, that's totally it. Then Princess Peach must be here too, don't you think? And the Crystal Star must be here too. We gotta find it, Mario. <laughs> Wait, here we go. Okay, so we're gonna listen to this music second, but after that, that'll probably be it. New part.
Okay, so, yeah, I mean, that's still pretty good. If I'd known about this music, I'd probably have made Purple Coins Radical Rave level use this. I mean, it's not too late. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. But, uh, I mean, it isn't, but you no, know, you don't have to do that. But, I mean, I will say... Okay, my, my expectations were set kind of low because somebody was like, eh, you know, it's not quite as good. But I still think this is really good. That being said, the original does hit a little bit different. There's a mashup of the original and the remake versions on YouTube, and it's fantastic. Uh, post that in the Discord if you can. I'd like to hear that. I mean, I'm sure it wouldn't be hard to find, but, you know. Do you perhaps drink Volvic? Do you perhaps drink? Do you perhaps drink? Do you perhaps drink? Yes, I do! But yeah, I'd say I'd say they did it justice though. And that's good because I I was a little worried. The original I think is just like a bit bassier. But anyway. Uh thank you for tuning in everybody. It's it was good to see all of you. Next time we'll you know do the rest of that. But until then you have a y'all you y'all have yourselves a good you have yourself a good, and if you don't, I'll find out. I will find out, so you better.